was Dan Perez's first time into a newly developed plot. In the heat of the moment, an arrow was released, but it obviously didn't hit the 12 ring. First, we must understand that Dan wasn't aiming for the 12 ring. In fact, he was aiming for the center mass of this buck. Okay, so I said center punch. Well, let me explain. Depending on the, on the situation, I mean, if, if everything is perfect, if a, if a buck is broadside and, uh, and you're downwind of him and he's within your efficiency, the perfect shot is just behind the, the shoulder, maybe three or four inches. That's a perfect shot, boom, right in the lungs. He expires very, very quickly. However, the problem with this area is if they are alert, as these deer were, the does were already alert, they were downwind, and uh, this buck had no intentions of hanging around. So time is of the essence. So, and, I opened that window, didn't have long to get a shot off. Everything was going on. I knew, I knew any second now I'm going to get busted. So I center punch. And what I mean by center punch is you're about in that liver area. So, so if, he, if he bolts down, lunges down to lunge away, and the shot goes, went to the left in this particular case, I've got all this lung mass. And if he doesn't, I've got all this liver. And that's where I actually struck him was right, right in the liver area. Uh, within the thoracic cavity and the worst case scenario I'm back into the intestines which me I'm not scared of um, no I do not want the animal to to suffer any longer than it than it should uh, but the reality is that I, I don't know how to measure what an animal suffers I know that if a shot does go in that direction I've got all this that death will ensue he's gonna die there's no question you know I mean the philosophy behind our archery, and it started back when bows shot uh, about 150 feet uh, per second, at, was a fast bow when we we're shooting recurves, and shot broadheads that were long and narrow because penetration was very important then because they were not producing the kinetic energy that they're producing today. Today, I shoot a, uh, a rocket hammerhead. It punches a hole that's uh, three bladed, two inches all the way around, so a hole that big is going through that animal. 